Hi all, I am going to emphasize how do we upload a Creative Commons license videos into YouTube. First we have to sign in in your YouTube. So I am already signed in. After reaching the sign in, so you may get this kind of interface. So in this interface, the right side near to your photo or your logo. If you look on to the right side, you may find the small options like a plus symbol option that is called creative video or post. If you click here, you may find out a small pop-up menu. One is called upload video. The second one is for the YouTube live. The third one is for creative post. But now I'm going to be highlight how to upload the video as a creative common license. For that, I'm clicking the upload videos. Once we click the upload videos, the next small interface may open. This interface for upload the videos. We can upload the videos through drag and drop videos. But now I'm going to the select file options. Once we click the select file options, it tells the file locations. My file is in desktop, so that's why I'm selecting the desktop. In the desktop, which file you want to be uploaded, you can select the file. This is my file. I like to add this file, therefore I'm selecting this file. After selecting this file, you can go for open. Once you click open, now the video is to be uploaded. In this interface, the details, video element visibly. There's a three steps it may involve to upload the videos. This is a file name. If you want to change the file name, we have to change the file name, the title. Just I'm going to be modify like this, how to find or search or filter. So just I'm giving the filter option. Then the description is option only, but if you like to give the description is good. So that's why I'm giving this, this kind of descriptions. The video described how to find a Creative Commons videos on YouTube. Now I'm giving the descriptions. After giving the description, if you come down, it was the thumbnail. So the thumbnail, we can select or upload a feature that shows what is your video. So normally a good thumbnail stands out and draw viewers attention. So it's better to be give you uh, the heading or some kind of template we have to add. I'm already having a template, image template. So this is a template, Creative Commons videos template. Just I'm adding this template. Once we added this, and this template only it shows the audience. So it may catching, it may attract the audience to follow our video or to see the video. Then if you come down, you may find out the option called playlist. I have already made lot of playlist options. Uh, if you want to create new playlist, we can make it a new playlist uh, in this new playlist option. But I don't like to go with a new playlist. I am already having this much of playlist. So this is like a tech tips as well as online tools based. That's why I am clicking this two thing. Then I am clicking the done. So once you click the done, the playlist will be over. Then if you come down little, it was the audience, whether it is the videos made for kids. I select as you know, it's not made for kids. The, then after clicking the audience if you come down this option called more options click the more options in the more options you may get the some of the details uh, we have to give the details uh, so tag so it, what is the use for tag in the sense uh, it may be very useful for if the content in your video is commonly misspelled otherwise tags play a minimal role in helping the viewers for uh, find your videos better we can give the key terms of a video so this video is talking about the creative commons creative Commons search creative common video search then then youtube so like that i'm giving this much of tags so after typing the tag i'm coming down for the language i've made already fixes in english as a language this for recording date so today is the 12th therefore i'm selecting this date video location i am making so the university name central university of kerala so the, there only I make this video. So I'm selecting these locations. After the selecting the location, this is important. So this only I may highlighting much license and distribution. So in the YouTube, there is only the two license. One is called standard YouTube license. Other one is called Creative Common license. I hope you already familiar with the Creative Common license. But I like to here I may upload my video as a Creative Common license based on. That's why I'm clicking the Creative Common attributions license. So it means that I am sharing the information and sharing the video as a Creative Commons license based. This is very much important. So the license and distributions. Then after selecting the license distribution Creative Commons, come down to the category. My videos related to the education. That's why I'm selecting the education. Then after finishing this, you can wait up to the upload process to be over. So we may get this kind of option processing HD version HD is complete. It means that the detail 
uh, the entire detailed things we did in a proper manner so this is way we have to confirm so i already mentioned that for uploading the video there is a three steps one is called detail give the their entire detail in the detail only consist of this much of informations one is called detail then descriptions then thumbnail playlist then whether it uh, age restriction is there then tax then language recording date this is very much important let's call license and distribution then finally category then we are getting this kind of option finishing process everything is to be properly done in the sense we may get this kind of option finished processing options then go to the next step the next step is called video element the last step is called visibility i am going to the video elements options next interface there i am clicking the add options it is to promote related content at the end of your video i am clicking the add options in the add options i am going with the first element so from here uh, 2.24 to 2.29 some kind of advertisement may come related to my videos so i am clicking as a element i am clicking as a save see here you may get the tick mark uh, the details to be over the view elements once you click the next see here the second steps to be over the last step is visibility in the visibility to asking whether you want to uh, visible the content may be visible in private or unlisted or public private means only you and people choose can watch your videos unlisted means anyone with the link can watch the videos public in the sense everyone can watch your videos i like to publish my content uh, in a public mode therefore i am selecting as a public after selecting this public of visibility i am clicking publish so once we click publish that my videos to be published in the worldwide anyone can view my content hereafter this way we have to upload the content as a creative common license based video so after this if you want to share in your facebook or your linkedin you can use uh, this option if you want to see this video you can click this options uh, automatically you can see the video otherwise if you want to share the link to someone you can copy this link and share to someone i hope you may understand how to upload a video as a creative comma license based in the youtube it may be very useful for you because most of the people confusing how we can upload the youtube video even some people knows how to upload the videos in youtube they not much aware of it how to upload the video as a creative comma license so that's why i did the demonstration hopefully it may be very useful for you we will meet in the next video bye